next gathering. Yeah. 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 yeah, yeah, cheers. It's been too long. It's been too long. Next year, I think. Next year? Italy. Yes. Divine wine, Debbie. What is it? Mm, Chianti, from the Cassiano di Pesa region. It's a fabulous area. Hanny, this cook that Jules recommended, insisted on it. I do hope this food's okay. <laughs> Can't say I've seen Jules lately. Mm. We all want one of her jaunts. <laughs> <laughs> so what's this guy Hanny got up his sleeve for us tonight? Then? You know what these chefs are like. He wants everything to be a surprise. Except this is going to be his speciality. <laughs> do you know, he wouldn't even let me meet him at the door. Tell you what, George, darling, you'll hold the fort for a while. I'm just going to go and check on things in the kitchen. Don't know about you, but I'm starving, and these father beans will be getting cold. Yes. No. Top up. Yeah. Uh, yes. Something smells nice. Now you can see where our young Jamie gets it from. Half a bottle of wine, at least, at night. No problem. <laughs> Only half a bottle? Do you call that a problem? I don't know. I mean, half a bottle, that's got to be five units. And judging by the size of your glasses, George, that's about one glass. <laughs> <laughs> yes, but come on, that's twice the limit, isn't it? I mean, it can't be much good for her liver. Marinated in four glasses of wine a night for two years. Makes you wonder what a liver would look like. I think I can help you there. My speciality dish. I'm sorry to say it's not up to my normal standards. Debbie had obviously had a couple of glasses too many already. What a waste. She clearly didn't know how to counter units. Cirrhosis has a nasty habit of taking its toll on the liver. You should take great care of you, Zemma. 